This right here is after New Year's. We threw a little party just with, you know, the regular guys, the girls, sorry, the girls around. And uh, I must say, I never had so much fun in my life. They're amazing people. And here's my wife dancing with her mother, which is a beautiful sight and something that I'm gonna keep forever. It is really, really amazing. And Thai people are so awesome to party with. They are so fun. They just want to relax and laugh and drink and have a good time. There's no seriousness, no nothing. It is just, oh my God, it's so amazing. So definitely try this if you come to Thailand. Just have a party with a bunch of Thai people. It is really amazing. They are so fun. <laughs> Very, very embarrassing, but here I am dancing, of course, with the crowd. Don't be shy, don't be anything. Nobody is judging you, nobody is doing everything. It is just so fun, it is amazing. So definitely join the Thai people when they're out on the dance floor dancing it is so fun and they're just laughing at you they you know you're laughing at them it's a fun time nobody take it serious it's really amazing <laughs> so right here we're about to go and get the bus to bangkok and go back and uh, yeah one of the last times here so this is the bus inside you should look at it outside it is all painted everything is beautiful there's light it is just really gorgeous but it's a long trip so right now we're in the back of the bus and we have all this space for us really amazing freaking luxurious vip bro Riding with the neon lights, the bus is graffiti, it's amazing. It doesn't really look like a bus, it looks more like a party bus kind of thing. It's amazing. Coming in at the bus at 7 a.m. in the morning, and we're currently taking a tuk tuk to wherever we gotta go. And uh, I could take these ones in the morning if I had to go to work, man. That'd be the most beautiful thing. If I had to go to work in the morning and take a tuk tuk, that would be awesome. That part, but uh, unfortunately, so we just got off the tuk tuk now we're trying to look for some food, god damn it. <laughs> Why you never walk around with these in Bangkok, man? It sucks. It generally sucks. So. Yeah, right now we're looking for some food. We gotta get some food. I think I fucked up my wheel. Yeah, I'm good. We're gonna look for some food and get some food because we came in with the bus way too late. But uh, it's currently 7 in the morning and just doing tuk tuk, which I could really get used to a tuk tuk in the morning when you drive, have to drive to work, man. I swear. It's the most amazing experience in the world. It's really amazing. So, yeah, we missed something in Denmark. Definitely make that. But uh, we're gonna find some breakfast and report back. We cannot get a grab, we cannot get a line man, whatever the hell it's called in Bangkok. Imagine that. 7, 8 in the morning and you can't get anything, anybody to ride you. That's messed up. That is messed up, man. Come on, guys, you gotta do better than that. It's Bangkok, for fuck's sake. It's not uh, Copenhagen or anything like that. Come on, man. And even when you, when you look at the cabs, see how busy it is? Everybody busy. Even the cab drivers are busy, you can't do anything, everybody gotta do work, everybody gotta feed their grandmother, everybody gotta do everything. So yeah. So right now we are thinking about the subway, but as I told her, the subway does not drive out to her. So we can't really do that. God damn, it's loud out here. Uh, welcome to Central Bangkok, I guess. But uh, we're trying to figure a way in <laughs> at home. Yeah. After so many hours in the bus, and my wife is stressfully but unsuccessfully trying to get us home. But, uh, you know, she's trying, she's a gorgeous girl. So she, I definitely trust her to get the job done. So no worries about that. I mean, she's a Bangkok girl, so she knows what's up. Anyway, man, we're trying to get a ride. Or either we're gonna go food or we're gonna go home. I really don't know yet, but uh, now you yeah. know. It's a little travel right here because we are very tired. We really want to take a shower. 
and we really want to go sleep, I guess, take a nap, whatever you call it. So we're going to figure that out, and I might record if we figure something out or record when we get home. But uh, yeah, just know in Bangkok, it's very, very stressful in the morning because everybody has to do something, and they do not stop in their way to help you. So yeah, F it, man. This is how it is. Fuck it. That's life. But uh, let's try to find a way home. Finally got a grab and uh, it took a long time, I think 40 minutes or something like that, but right now we're on the way home. We're gonna order some food into home because we're so tired and we just wanna sleep, we just wanna relax. And we're gonna order some food home, so yeah. We're gonna ride, I forget that. I never wanna go there again, but yeah. it's part of the experience in Thailand, I guess. Adventure, I don't know, 12,000 plus. So I just want to give a little update, we are home and uh, we did got two pizzas and we got a, a chicken sandwich, spicy chicken sandwich from uh, my wife's place where she worked and it was really amazing, it tasted so good after that we went to sleep, sleep until 5, then we walked outside and I'm sorry I didn't film, I just wanted to relax, it's been a hard time sitting in the bus so that's currently where we at right now, but, uh, go sleep soon I guess, just so, yeah, anyway, thank you so much for watching this vlog, I really appreciate it, but I'm gonna sign off for today, so yeah. Love you guys. Good morning, everybody. See what my wife cooked me up right here, man. Jesus Christ. Must have done something right, right? <laughs> what a gorgeous wife I have. She knows my heart. That's why she's the most amazing woman in life. Wow. So never in my life have I ever seen this shit, ever. So this is a Thai dish, a Thai candy kind of sweet thing. And they put ice inside of <laughs> Of the thing, I never eat anything like this in my life, my entire life. It tastes okay. It's not really something you want to eat the whole bowl of, but it tastes okay. It's not that bad whatsoever. So just be aware of that, that there's ice in this if you ever get it. So this is exactly the whiskey, the Thai whiskey I was drinking at New Year's. It is strong. Really amazing though. It tastes good.